Okay guys, today I'm flashing a Xbox 360 Samsung MS28 disk drive. <coughs> There's only one difference in the MS25 and MS28 flash. I'll show you that in a second, Jungle Flasher. Alright guys, I've already got my Molex my power supply plugged in my CK3 Lite. I've got my X360 USB. Uh, you all should already know how to eject the tray half open. Pretty self-explanatory, honestly. <laughs> Okay, everything's hooked up, ready to go. Jungle Flasher is up. My firmware is loaded in. Uh, using the iExtreme uh, Light Touch version 2.0, which is the latest for Sammy. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna get started with this. Okay, uh, assuming you already have this downloaded, go to MTK Flash. For me, I'm using USB. Click the USB only. Make sure your port is a zero in here. <laughs> Make sure it says USB Primary Master. And it detects your executor 360 USB Pro. Alright, that was fast, sorry. <laughs> anyway, now I'm going to take my drive. Just refresh the drive properties. The Shiba Samsung Corporation. Uh, H9438 MS28, which is what I'm doing. Alrighty. Drive is Samsung. Since it's an MS28, you're going to go semi-unlock. Okay. Now, if it's, if it's just a uh, MS25... Let's go straight to intro drive ID, then read, then write, then outro reset. But since I'm on MS28, instead of doing the intro, I'll do semi unlock first. Alright. Okay. In vendor mode, parallel flash, you're good. Status X70. Alrighty. That's good. <laughs> Complete done. Okay. It's good, it's good. Okay, we're gonna go to read. <laughs> Reading the banks on the chip. Okay. Guys, make sure it says status 0x70. Alright. That should say drive in vendor mode. Okay. Dumped. Alright, you're gonna save all these. <laughs> gonna put Logan in there so I know it's mine. We're gonna save a bunch of these. We already loaded that. Okay. Loading. Hold on a second, guys. Sorry about that. I know I'm calling. Never mind. Alrighty. Sorry about that. Alrighty, we're back now. So so far we have clicked Sammy unlock, and we've clicked the read. We saved it and make sure it says spoof source to target. <laughs> now, once it's good, then we're gonna say <laughs> save this file. Go back to MTK Flash, and we are going to write. Okay, it's gonna erase the bank, and it's gonna write the bank to the chip. <laughs> and all the way through this, you should be in uh, status 0x70 and still in vendor mode. And you do not need to cycle the power on the drive on this one to get it in vendor mode. All you have to do is have your drive halfway up and just make sure it's turned on. Red light, you're good to go. And uh, I'm, not, I'm not using a SATA, uh, SATA card or anything. I'm using this here. I have to press it to USB and I can use it on a laptop, not just a desktop. Anyway, let's go back to this. Routing bank to... There are three banks on all DVD drives that Xboxes have, so it's almost done writing. So it's looking good, guys. Last bank, three. Still looking good. <clears throat> and after this, it's just going to go through a write verification process. Just to take a second, make sure your drive has uh, had the firmware wrote correctly. Right, row the banks. 
Flash verification test, reading all three banks. <laughs> and uh, it's be a second here. It'll be good to go. Alright, right verified. Okay, that's good. Alright, um, now, last thing to do is outro slash ATA reset. That just takes out of vendor mode, and you should see all their job properties come up again right here. Well, actually, you won't on this. That's 28, because then that's 28, uh, it does not go back to vendor mode unless it's an unlocked. But anyway, let's see, right, very fat, okay. Sending vendor out, vendor outro to your port, and you're good to go, guys. So, I'm gonna run it through and test it for you. Here's to make sure it, make sure it, uh, ejects properly. back in the 360 <laughs> all right have a burning game right now to test and show you all but I will put one on there very shortly and I'm just gonna plug it up I'm not gonna turn the video on because you all know that if it's gonna eject now it's gonna work anyway so Going good. I just don't want to eject button on there yet. Alrighty, though. Oh, I got 12 volt fan while I'm done with this. By the way, that's why it's, it's running so loud. Okay, signing off, guys. I have a test run of Black Ops burn for you. Thanks. Out.